In this video, we are going to give you a brief introduction to the slice settings in Chitubox. If you click the slice settings button above the slice button on the common settings tab, the slice settings window will open. These settings allow you to choose the right printer for you to slice your model, customize your slice profiles, and adjust settings in these profiles. On the left side of the slice settings window, you can add or select a printer slice profile. If you click Add New Printer, a small window will pop up showing a list of supported printers. Select your printer from the list and a new profile will appear. You can also choose another existing profile or select a profile and click Remove Printer to remove it. On the right are the detailed settings for a printer profile. On the top, you can choose a resin profile for that machine profile. For some printers, the software has some built-in resin profiles which contain possibly ideal settings for that printer and resin. There is an Add New Profile button next to the resin profile list. You can click it to add a new custom resin profile. You can change the current profile name by clicking Edit Profile Name button. If you don't like the current profile, click Remove Profile to remove it. The Reset Current Profile button can help you reset the settings of the current profile. You can also import or export the current or all profiles. To know more about these, please watch the Import Export Configuration video. Below are the detailed settings in a profile. They include the machine, resin, print, G-code, and advanced settings. They will be explained in details in the videos for each of these tabs.